Well, happy Friday, everyone. This was our first full week of, um, well, online learning, really. And I'm so thankful for everyone who has joined my YouTube page and has participated in the at-home art class lessons. I love hearing um, messages from you. I love photographs from you. It uh, really makes my day. So your Friday lesson is a little bit more involved and I'm hoping you are going to include your family in on this. Actually, you're probably gonna need your family for a little bit of help with this anyways. So let me explain. What you're going to do, and I have a list here. No, I'm gonna hold it up. My camera likes to go out of focus, so that's, that's why I see, you'll see me put my hand in here so it'll focus. Um, you're going to recreate one of these famous works of art. There's the Grant Wood, American Gothic, Norman Rockwell, Freedom from Want. It's really the Thanksgiving picture. Vincent van Gogh, self-portrait with the bandage and pipe. Leonardo da Vinci's Last Supper. Vermeer's painting, Girl with the Pearl Earring, and The Milkmaid. And then the last one, Edvard Munch's The Scream. Probably wondering right now, okay, that all sounds great, Mrs. Lawrence, but I do not know what they look like. Well, you've probably seen them in art class before. So this is a picture of Grant Wood's American Gothic. So there's two people in the painting. And in the background, notice what's in the background. I would suggest, and this is where the adults come in, that you Google Grant Wood American Gothic images and it'll pull up a whole bunch for you to look at. So this is a great one to do. And you're probably wondering, well, how am I gonna recreate this? What do you want me to do? Paint it, draw it, what am I supposed to do? No, no, this is what you're gonna do. I have an example. So here is someone's example of how they recre recreated it. There's Grant Wood's painting, but now this is what they did. And notice how the man is holding something, he's holding a skateboard, and the girl behind him, and the house behind. So I thought that was an awesome job of recreating that famous painting. All right, so let me move on. So Grant Wood, that's one choice. Then this is an all-American favorite, Norman Rockwell. Of course, when I Google it, I just Google Norman Rockwell Thanksgiving dinner but the real title of the painting is Freedom from Want. So you're gonna look at this and notice the people in the picture gathered around a table, um, the grandfather, grandmother, serving something. So recreate that. I don't have an example of this one, but hopefully you have some ideas kicking around in your head right now. All right, let's go to the next one. Vincent Van Gogh, self-portrait with the bandage on his ear and the pipe. This was after he made that really sad choice of cutting off his ear and got it bandaged up and he's smoking his pipe. Notice his hat, the background. This one, a very famous painting by Leonardo da Vinci, The Last Supper. And if I hold this up close, you can see all the gestures everyone is doing. I did this project, gosh, probably about 15 years ago, and a family really got into it. And they were all wearing like white sheets in the style of the clothing that you see here. And um, I think they had their, their aunts and uncles involved. They had their whole family involved in this one. So try to see what you can do. I'll set this aside, and what's next? Uh, one of my favorites, this is Vermeer's Girl with Pearl Earring. Okay. And another Vermeer, and this is the Milkmaid. 
And of course, you've got to notice what she's doing, what's on the table with her, what's in the background. And then everyone knows the scream. And every time I mention the scream painting, everyone thinks it's the movie. Now the painting. Again, if you choose to recreate this one, notice where they are. Try to recreate the background. This is water back here. See what you can do to figure that out. Now I have a couple more examples to show you. One of them happens to be the scream. So here's the scream and then this person's idea of recreating it. That's pretty cool. And then this one, now Frida Kahlo was not on my, my list, but you can certainly give it a try. This was a self-portrait Frida Kahlo did of herself. And then this child was recreated like Frida. So I hope you have an idea of what to do. I'm going to come back to this again, and I'm going to hold, hold this up so you can see again. And you can always pause the video here so you can write down the artist and the picture. I really can't wait to see what some of you come up with. So this is a big one. This is a big project. So get mom and dad involved, your siblings, and let's see what kind of crazy fun we can have. I look forward to seeing your recreations of these famous works of art. See you on Monday.